Mules or clogs, whatever you name it, are a big part of my rotation to say the least and recently I added a new set of mules to my rotation, the Ame Leondor Garden Mules. But before I talk about the mules, I want to give credit to Manny Omito who influenced me to getting on board with the said mules. He really just has a great way of styling them, may it be streetwear or casual. He just really makes the garden mules look so good on any outfit. And he's just definitely a great fashion icon overall. And I totally recommend you follow him if you want to develop your style because he's one among many that I look up to for inspiration. The garden mule definitely does resemble the look of any nursing or medical clogs. And my girlfriend does really make fun of me for how they look but I like them nevertheless. And some might say that I just got them simply because they are Amelion Dor. And yes, to a point. And like I said, I was inspired by Manny Omito, hence why I got on board. A little backstory. The mules were not available in my size a little over a week ago and luckily they restocked. I was only aiming to get the green pair but I ended up getting the black pair as well and you guessed it, I was influenced by the guy that I just mentioned a while ago. The unboxing experience was very simple. The mule came in a ziplock bag with Amelion Door logo imprinted on it and I am honestly digging it. The mules themselves were placed in a cream net bag with Ame Leondor patch stitched on the bag. I find this type of packaging really neat and simple and the great thing is I can reuse both the Ziploc and the net bag. The mules are made up of 85% regular EVA and 15% rubber. The Ame Leondor logo is embossed at the heel and outsole of the mule. The footbed of the shoe is made up of a solid cork and cork laminate that is removable for cleaning. And the cork foot bed also has the Amelie Undor logo laser etched on it. The mule's outsole has a molded micro texture for traction and the sizing embossed on it as well. Sizing wise, the garden mules only come in full sizes. I am a 7.5 and, and got myself a 7. It is also indicated at the outsole of the shoe that the mule fits both a 7 and a 7.5. And so I suggest going to the next lowest full size if you are an in-between size like myself. Comfort wise, the cork footbed is a little hard unlike the soft footbed on my Birkenstock Boston but I have been wearing mine around the house to see how they break in. And so far it seems that the footbed seems to start molding on the shape of my foot but I have to really wear it more before ruling out if it's not comfortable. Also, since the footbed is removable, I find that the mules can be worn without it. This is something that I am yet to try to see if it looks good or not. But right now, I will stick to wearing it with the footbed inserts in. The retail price on the garden mule is 140 Canadian dollars. And if I'm being honest, it is too pretty expensive for a clog that resembles a nursing clog. But I guess any Amelie Ondor piece comes with a price. Also, another clog that resembles the look of the garden mule that is in the same price range is the Birkenstock Super Berkey, which is priced at 120 Canadian dollars. I do not own a pair of this so I cannot say how it compares to the garden mule in terms of comfort. Here are some outfits I did put together to show how the mules look on feet. stoked that I was able to pick these mules. For one, I was not sure if Amelion Dor would restock my size as the brand is known to release pieces without any foreseeable restocks, but I'm glad that they did with these mules. And at the time of making this video, they pretty much have a full size run on all four colors of the mule. Do I recommend it? If you have the money to spend then sure. I would say that there are other mules or clogs that look just as good for less money just like the Super Berkey from Birkenstock. The garden mules I would say is much more of a luxury than it is a necessity if you are in the market for a clog. One might say then why did I buy it? That is because I really like how they look and I am a big fan of the brand. Not to mention Manny Umeto styling them added fuel to the fire. All in all, I am happy with the garden mules and cannot wait to style them. Anyways, I hope you guys liked this video as much as I did and until next time, stay safe, stay fitted, peace.